Hey everyone, Technomancer here with a video for you guys. In today's video, I'm going to show you how to fix incorrect screen time on iOS 18. So you might have noticed, if you go into your setting and look at screen time, this data might not be correct. And you might see really a large time spent, which you might have not done, and it's showing incorrect, and you're going to follow these steps to fix it. So the very first thing you're going to do is, starting in the main settings here, you're going to go to General, and then you're going to go to background app refresh and you want to turn this setting off so you're going to click on off right here and we're going to completely turn these off because these apps are running in the background it's assuming that you're using them and you might not be using them so we need to turn that off now after you have done that we're going to go back to the main settings and this time we're going to go to screen time and then go all the way down and turn off app and website activities we're going to turn this off and that will turn off the screen time reporting. And now we're going to follow this step and then turn it back on. We're going to quickly press and release the volume up, volume down, and then hold on to this side button. So I'm going to quickly press and release volume up, volume down, then hold on to that side button. You're going to wait until the screen goes completely black and the Apple logo reappears before letting go of that side button. So as you can see here, I'm waiting for that Apple logo to show up again, and then I let go. If it doesn't work the very first time, keep on trying it. You want to make sure you quickly press and release volume up, volume down, and then hold on to that side button. So we're going to wait until we get back to the phone. Basically, this is forcing the software to shut down and then reload the code. So if it's a bug with the code, it's going to go ahead and fix that. And then once you're back on, you're back, and this time you're going to go back, open up your settings, and this time you're going to go first general, and then we're going to go to date and time. We're going to make sure that date and time is set correctly. Sometimes it is not in the correct zone, like if you're moving around. So we're going to turn that off, make sure these are correct, and then let it automatically detect it. But it should be the time that you're in correctly. Now let's go back to the main settings. And this time we're going to go back to screen time and then app reporting and website data. And then we're going to turn screen time back on again so that data is refreshed if you're seeing incorrect data before. Now, after you have done that, if still later on you see still not working, you're going to go into your settings, general, software update, update the phones to the latest software version, a previous version might have bugs, so it's always good to update the latest version. And finally, let's say you did all of this and you're still seeing an issue with it. In that case, you're going to go to settings, general, Scroll all the way down to where it's a transfer reset iPhone. Click on a reset and we're going to reset all settings. Now this is only going to reset all of your settings after you put the passcode. It will not delete any of your data like photos, videos, apps, but something you need to do in order to fix this as well. So hopefully all of this is helpful. If so, please consider a like and subscribe button for more tips and tricks. We'll see you guys next time.